Hello and welcome back to another Aunt Sandy cocktail recreation video. In today's video, I am going to recreate a cocktail that has been requested many, many times. And for all of you who requested this drink, I kind of hate you because this doesn't sound good. We are making Aunt Sandy's noteworthy. This cocktail is apparently a cocktail for the gals. I'm going to make a nice picture for the girls. And we enjoy it on sunny days. It's a beautiful, bright, sunny day outside. In our sundresses. A little girl luncheon with sundresses. My Oakland Days t-shirt will have to suffice. We're going to get started. So into a pitcher with ice. According to Sandra Lee, we're going to put equal parts of coffee liqueur, anise liqueur, which is basically Sambuca, and heavy cream. However, because we all know Aunt Sandy, she is not consistent with her pores, and we're going to count the seconds instead. So, starting with our... It smells... By the way, it smells so good because I have some coffee beans for the garnish. Oh, these are these beans are super super fresh it makes me want a cup of coffee but no we're gonna have a cup of alcohol into this pitcher we are pouring a six second pours worth of coffee liqueur which is Kahlua in my case I like Kahlua so maybe this will be okay one two three four five six this next ingredient is the one that I'm worried about. She says it's equal parts of coffee liqueur to Sambuca or to anise liqueur, but she definitely pours more of this. She pours a nine second pour of it. So that's what we're gonna do. Oh, nine second pour of Sambuca. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's too much. Oh, and Sandy, look at how much I poured in. This, oh my God. Whew, I can smell this from here. We're going to top this off. It's supposed to be an equal part of heavy cream, but she puts the least amount of non-alcoholic ingredients in all her cocktails. We should know this by now. So we're only going to pour... Uh, a five second pour of heavy cream into the drink. One, two, three, four, five. Oh God. Oh God. Did you mean like half and half instead, Aunt Sandy? She said heavy cream. I'm just gonna put in here some heavy cream. This don't look right. Can you see how fucking thick this is? It's like licorice ice cream in here. Before I even continue, I'm just gonna take the proper precautions and I am going to pop a lactate. So let's look at the layers. <laughs> and Sandy, please be so fucking for real right now. Nope. Yeah, yeah, immediately no. Immediately no. Just, just from looking at it, nope. She called. She said heavy cream, like the shit that you turn into whipped cream. Why? Why? Okay, well, we're gonna get rid of that. Cause you know how we roll around here. We use our finger strainer. Oh, lordy lord, I'm just making a mess. Oh, the finger strainer is not sufficient. Who would have saw that coming? You know what? Let's just stop right there. Let's grab some paper towels. Oh, come on. Fucking mess right here. Okay, so so far it looks like a it looks like an iced coffee drink. We're going to garnish this with a few coffee beans because that's not a choking hazard. Okay. <sighs> mm, I just want you guys to get a good look at that. Okay. All right. Let's taste it. Cheers.
Oh. Take two. No. 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 It tastes like milk and licorice. Mm. No. Absolutely not. And Sandy, are you fucking out of your mind? This, I'm sorry. This is just a waste of ingredients. This is so, and it's nasty looking. You can see my Haktua in here. I'm sorry, that gets a zero out of 10. Absolutely not. You know what, I'm done with the video. I, have, I, I can't even do my regular outro. Why the, I still done things I do for views.